In this video, we'll talk about using if statements. If statements are used to apply an operation to a subsample in your data set. You can use them with most data commands. The syntax for using if statements is command if conditions comma options. By command, I mean a state of command like any you'd use. Usually in state of commands there's a comma before the options. Before that comma is where you insert your if statements. For example, if I use the command sum income if sex equals equals one comma detail, I'm asking Stata to summarize the variable income only for observations whose sex variable is equal to one. The if conditions use a variable to set the condition, a logical operator, and a value or a second variable. In this example, I use the variable sex to create the condition. The logical operator was is equal to 1 sets the condition of whether or not the operation will be applied to an observation. Let's see what it's like to use an if statement in a real state of session. Here's an example of using an if statement. If we run a regular tab, for example, compress, we'll get the entire samples distribution across the variable compress. We can look at variable distributions in isolated groups. For example, the sex variable allows us to look at men or women only results. Remember to use the no labels option to find out which numbers correspond to which labels. Let's look at confidence in TV. By putting tab con TV if sex equals equals one, we get only the male results. For sex equals two, we see only 11% of females have a great deal of confidence in TV. You can use if statements to look at any subsamples in Stata. Let's review. If statements can be used to apply Stata commands to subsamples. The syntax is, after a command, we type in if and the conditions. The conditions set out the terms that will determine whether or not the command is applied to an observation. If the observation satisfies the condition, the operation will be applied to it. If it doesn't, the operation will ignore it. 